go on floor. I'm moving upstairs. Sarge, this is James McCarthy. He's one of the care workers. Hello, Mr. McCarthy. Please take a seat. I'm Detective Sergeant Noble. Will someone tell me what's going on? I'm afraid I've got some bad news. Michael Barker was found dead outside the care home in the early hours of this morning. Mike's dead? What the fuck happened? Can you identify this man? Does he live here? Why are you showing me this? But that's my little brother, Dylan. Keep Mr. McCarthy in there. Have someone run a background check and get him breathalyzed. I found this in the security room. Search the premises for alcohol. I'm gonna go and find Dylan. Should we wait for a social worker? I've dealt with this time before. I just need a few minutes. Hello, Dylan. My name's Elizabeth Noble. I'm a police detective. Do you know why I'm here? James says I'm not to um, talk to people I um, don't know. Well, someone died yesterday when your brother was on duty. It could mean he's in a lot of trouble. Leave uh, um, James alone. OK, I'm on your side, but I can only help you and James if you tell me what happened. I don't know what um, um, happened. OK. Well, what were you doing at 9pm last night? I was uh, getting a um, drink. Dylan, you there? Dylan? Ah. Come on, do you want to join the back of the queue? Do we have to go through this every time, Dylan? Can I, um, um, um play? Dylan! It's all right, mate. Leave him to me. Only if you promise to take your medication. First, you have to win against me. If only you were as good as you think you are. You're too soft on him, Dylan. You need to take your medication first, then you can play. Okay. I'm not thirsting, Mike. What have you got? 
you're against Mike? Uh, uh, um, nothing. At five past nine, Dylan McCarthy, that's you, was in the common room playing pool with James McCarthy. The residents were being assisted with their evening medication. Come on, drink up, Sarah. Oh, yeah. I'm not thirsty either. Come on, drink up, you need to take your medication. Sarah, take your hand away from your mouth, please. Sarah, take your hand away from your mouth. I need you to take your medication. It's for your own good. Now, come on. Hmm? Sarah? Hand away from your mouth. Leave her a line. OK, that's it. Time for you to go to bed. Sorry, Sarah, but it's for your own good. Sarah? Oi, what do you two think you're doing? Get back Sarah, in Sarah, hand away from your mouth. Listen to me. Hand away from your mouth and take your medication, OK? You need to take your medication, Sarah, OK? Take your medication. Come on. There we go, good girl. <laughs> the fucking hell? Dylan! I have to say, Dylan, it doesn't look good, does it? An assault on Mike just three hours before he's found dead. Mike's? I am um, It's his fault. James goes angry. This place is a bloody mess. Get these clothes in the wardrobe now. I can't keep making excuses for you. You wasn't take his side. I didn't ask them to send you here. It's bad enough Mike being the only fucking guy who give me a job. Without you acting up. You should stop doing what Mike tells you. Listen, all the residents have uh, gone to bed. Mike, it's OK. I'm handling it. I've left something in the kitchen for you. Why don't you go and get it? I just want a quick chat, you know, before the pill kicks in. How are you, Dylan? You seem a bit tense. Hmm? Don't worry, I'm not angry. Hey? Why don't you come sit down? Come on. Come on. Sit down. Just want a little chat. Just a little chat, okay? I know it's not easy being the way you are. It's certainly kind of been easy for James, you know? All those years inside, now in here, with you. You should be thanking him. Hmm? Now, I want us to be friends. I really do, OK? Because you know James isn't going to be around forever. Great. Everything OK? Yeah. Could be better. Get ready for bed. See you in the morning. What did you do next? I can't remember. Come on, Dylan. Have a think. What did you say to my brother? I didn't want anything to be said. Don't you fucking touch it. Check on him, or he'll be looking for a new job. That won't be easy now, will it? With your record, huh? Now go watch those cameras. Not now. I've got something for you, Sarge. Sorry, Dylan. One moment, OK? What is it? 
Sergeant James McCarthy's refusing to take the breathalyzer. He's got a record. GBH and drink driving. Sergeant was only released six months ago. James started drinking when Mike left, didn't he? Um, I am, um, um, don't know. I went to bed. Don't lie to me, Dylan. I know when you're lying. James promised me he'd stopped um, drinking after um, Mum um, died. What did you say? I... I am... Um, James want to uh, say... Come on, Dylan, I need to know what happened. Mike... Um, um, did a... a, a, a bad uh, thing. My um, brother. But he's not your friend. He probably sees you as a burden. His little brother with Downs might be sick of taking care of you. Wishes you weren't here. Then why did he stop Mike? Dylan! What's going on? I told you not to touch him. Fuck you. Fuck your mum, brother. What did you say? I said, fuck you. It was an accident. He didn't mean for him to a uh, fool. Find a whiskey bottle. Mr. McCarthy's really kicking off. Okay, I'm coming. I've been asleep. I told you. I don't know what happened. Thanks for telling me, Dylan.
Time for you to go to bed. Sorry, Sarah, but it's for your own good. Sarah? Oi, what do you two think you're doing? Get back in the gym. There we go, good girl. What the fucking hell? I told you to leave her alone. You talk back to me, okay? I tell you to do something, you go and do it. And I said, you go back to bed. Thank you.